New at four, two West Milwaukee police officers who tased a mentally ill man before he died will not be criminally charged. Police responded to 22-year-old Adam Trammell apartment last May after neighbors called 911 worried he would harm himself. Ben Jordan is live at the West Milwaukee Police Department with more on what went into the district attorney's decision. Ben. Charles and Katie, the district attorney says those two officers were confronted with a very complex problem. However, their actions were not against the law. Tramell's parents, on the other hand, say that is a horrible decision. Let's take you back to May 25th of last year when West Milwaukee police arrived at Tramell's apartment. The report shows they broke down his door and found him naked in the shower. The 22-year-old suffered from schizophrenia. He did not reply to officers who then tased him more than a dozen times before placing him in handcuffs and taking him to the hospital where he was pronounced dead. The medical examiner's report says the use of the taser shocks was a significant condition leading to Trammell's death. The official cause of death was excited delirium, which is often sparked by mental illness. But the manner of death was not determined, was undetermined rather. Milwaukee County District Attorney made his decision on two factors. First, he says he believes there isn't su sufficient evidence that either officer directly or indirectly caused Trammell's death. Secondly, he doesn't believe the officers were abusive during the encounter. Both the Mo West Milwaukee Police Department and Trammell's family declined on-camera interviews today with an expected civil lawsuit to be filed. Greenfield Police helped with this investigation as an outside source. They plan to release body camera footage of the incident sometime next week. Reporting live in West Milwaukee, Ben Jordan, today's TMJ4. All right, Ben, thanks.